action. Okay. <laughs> Here you go. That was good. backpack, wearing another bag, while pulling a rolling suitcase, while riding a skateboard. I remember why I had to get rid of this old iPhone. The battery in this thing dies in like two seconds. It just, you fully charge and then... Tell you from uh, the internet. Nice car. I'm 100% not buying another iPhone. All set. Thank you very Have much, I appreciate it. In the, uh, in the episode where I dropped my phone into the river, a lot of people asked in the comments about what phone I use, whether it's like an iPhone or a, an Android phone, and the truth is I always use both. I believe in redundant systems, so I have Android, I have iOS, and then they're on different networks, so if like I don't get service from one over here, I might get service from the other over there. Usually it works. I am a pretty big cell phone nerd. I've hung on to most of the cell phones that I didn't lose or drop into rivers or whatever. Uh... Some of my old phones. That's my first iPhone. This thing was awesome. The Galaxy S3 was the first Android phone that I really liked because of this big screen. This was like so revolutionary back in the day. Then I got this Sony phone, which I liked because it was purple and waterproof, but I cracked it and water got in it and the thing was totally... And then I got the HTC, which I liked because of the speakers, but I literally dropped this into a toilet and that stopped working. I went in after it though, into the toilet. This Blackberry was sent to me by Blackberry because they wanted me to do like a video for it. And it sucked so bad I tried to sell it and I couldn't find anybody to buy it. This was my Note 3. I really liked this one because it had the pen. Then I got an iPhone 6, which these things break really easily and this one's pretty then when I did the Oscars thing, I got this Galaxy S7 Edge. This is my favorite phone. I liked it so much that I asked them to send me the gold one. And they sent me the gold one, but then I decided I liked the silver one better. So I never actually activated this gold one. And then there's also the iPhone now. So this is the current, this is the current lineup. Yeah, and that's kind of my current cell phone situation. Back at the airport. This mess of a line right here, that's for my flight. So the next 91 seconds of this episode are gonna be a Q&A. Ready? What's your least favorite part about airports? The security nonsense. Which is the best sport in America? NFL, NBA, MLS, MLB. Best sport in America? Skateboarding. Ever wanted a storm chase and film a tornado? No. Do you like magic tricks? Mm -hmm. When are you coming to Amsterdam? I think next week. Um, I think next week. Are you gonna visit the Philippines someday? I've been to the Philippines before. Great country. I hope to be back soon. Are you coming to Norway soon? No. When did you start wearing sunglasses every day? When I started doing this vlog. What are you most grateful for in life? My health. Are you more in love with the process or the result of creating things? The process. I love the making part. Vidcon, and if you go to Vidcon, can I please get a photo with you? I am one Oh, first. I am 100% going to Vidcon. I will be there. I will be as loud as possible. I want to... I love Vidcon. Do you plan to start another company? Yeah, probably. I don't know that I'll... E Aww. Hi, honey. Hi, are you at the airport yet? Yeah, the plane's like loading behind me. All right. Okay. I'll talk to you soon. Call me when you land or text me when you land or something. I will, honey. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. Will you ever come to Ireland? I'll be in Belfast soon-ish, like a couple weeks or something like that.
Do you know Krav Maga? Yes, I do know Krav Maga. I did Krav Maga for five or six years. All right, I gotta go. That's it. I'm not the first, I'm not the last. I'm like the middlest person to get on this flight. I've never been on this configuration before. I didn't realize I'm sitting backwards. That's the front of the plane, that's the back of the plane. Not that that's anything to complain about. I got an entire bed. I got my airplane pajamas. is a subscriber, total sweetheart, completely hooked up the car rental. Thank you, dude, at the car rental place. This car is great. Every time I get here, I get, I land at night and I can't see what I'm getting out. Every time I land here, for whatever reason, it's pitch black out. And today I land just as the sun's setting. It's such a nice way to arrive in this city. Caught every star in the midnight sky Caught every star in the midnight sky Remember when I was in San Francisco like three days ago? Stayed at that great hotel, climbed out of the window, went on the roof. Well, they got in touch with me and they invited me back. Thank you. Uh, I won't climb on the roof this time. And I'm staying there tonight, but but they did tell me that I would have a better room than last time, which I'm sorry for. All the last time, the room was great. Caught every star in the midnight sky. Yo, no boosted boards allowed in here, man. This is Sanjay. He is the founder and CEO of Boosted Board. I forgot my boosted board controller, but I brought this damn thing from New York and I texted him and he's here. What's up? You are a lifesaver, sir. <laughs> Anytime. <laughs> Look at this sky. Wow. All right, so they're super nice to me this time. They were nice to me last time too, super nice though. And I think they gave me a really good room. I hope they did. Uh, Sanjay's coming to check out the view just because I feel bad for making him come all the way to my hotel to give me my boosted board controller that I forgot. Oh good God, look at this room. Look at this place. Dude, you should move in here. This is nuts. That's insane. There's a telescope? Oh my god. 
Wow, Melissa at the Fairmont, I love you. Viewers of this vlog, get prepared for some of the most amazing time lapses you've ever seen. Look at this view. Oh. Thank you, sir, for bringing this by. You're a good man. No problem. Enjoy it. Good to see you, dude. Yeah, have a good trip here. This is the nicest, most opulent, most ridiculous, most ridiculous hotel room I've ever stayed in. Welcome back to the Fairmont San Francisco. Enjoy your stay, and please let us know if we can be of assistance. Melissa. Thanks for the room. I'm totally psyched. <laughs> Thank you very much. Take care. You too.